Hey there, everybody. <clears throat> Glenn Trayer, Trayer Wilderness. I uh, hope you're doing well and uh, everything's going good for you. Uh, yeah, I was uh, doing my devotions this morning and I kind of felt prompted uh, to do this video. Um, God showed me some things, uh, spoke to me, uh, the Holy Spirit did, and uh, pointed some things out to me that I needed to uh, to read um, and uh, I felt like he I needed to share it um, yeah I guess before we get started here um, I'm I'm just gonna pray and uh, we'll just kind of go from there so dear Lord uh, we thank you for your blessings each and every day, your mercy and grace, your unfailing love. I pray that you would speak um, to me, but also through me, um, speak to somebody and, and help them. And thank you again for all you do for us every day and your unfailing love. I ask these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Alright, so what I was uh, reading was uh, <coughs> in First uh, John, it's First uh, John chapter 5, verses, uh, oh, it's verses 14 and 15. Um, in my Bible it has little... Um, notes down here at the bottom well not notes but little uh, almost like Bible study type things like uh, just different stuff pertaining to different verses and stuff in the Bible so it's it's kind of cool um, but anyways uh, this verse is um, starting with 1st John chapter 5 verse uh, 14 and 15 um, I'm going to read that, and then I'm going to go over this uh, little study thing at the bottom. Um, it says, And we are confident that He hears us whenever we ask for anything that pleases Him. And since we know that He hears us when we make our requests, we also know that He will give us what we ask for. Um... I kind of uh, sometimes struggle with that, um, you know, how that all works and stuff, but this, I, I shouldn't say I struggle with it, but it, it's something that, you know, this was something God showed me this morning and something I need to, you know, pay attention to. Um, yeah, now I lost my train of thought. Anyways, um... There's there's a lot of things in these verses um, I think that get confused by people uh, that we take kind of takes in some ways take things out of context. Um, so I'm going to start reading this and uh, we'll talk about it here at the end. Um, prayer is not going. Prayer is not getting your will in heaven. It is getting God's will on earth. Prayer is not an agreement with God in which you try to persuade Him to move things your way. Prayer is an exercise in which His Spirit enables you to move yourself in, in His way. Prayer is not overcoming God's reluctance. It is laying hold of His willingness. Um, okay. We like to gravitate towards the latter part of these verses, <clears throat> but don't forget the first part. You have to first stay in Christ, in Christ by maintaining a healthy, ongoing relationship with Him. When, when that happens, you will see your will coming in line with His, 
and your requests will begin to mirror what God wants you to do in your life uh, and in the lives of those around you. At that point, you can be assured that God will listen to you and will answer your prayers. I think so many times, this is so true, so many times we take this and and take it out of context we, we we focus so much on our will and not following into his will and making our will his will uh, like it said there um we want to kind of twist that and and use it for our benefit instead of following into god's will um, for our lives and the things that we want. Um, we know that He will take care of us. Um, he provides us with what we need. Um, like food on our table and then clothes on our back and stuff. He does take care of us. and he does. Um, this is talking, I think, primarily about things that we want. Um, not necessarily things that we have to have. Um, but... Uh, I, I, I really feel that that um, <clears throat> a lot of times we do get mixed up with that. We get to uh, wanting our will. And so human nature, sinful nature, is like pulls us away from what God wants. Um, so we don't always follow what His will is, and that's where, when it is falls into line with God's will, uh, like it says, He will start answering our prayers, um, you know, for things that we ask for. Um, he knows what's good for us. He knows what's best for us. Um, I don't know, that's just kind of... it. it spoke to me this morning and I felt that I should um Holy Spirit was guiding me to say something make this video so um yeah hopefully uh hopefully that helps somebody out um and uh you get something out of it I guess uh this is gonna be a short little video but I'm gonna pray here quick and then we're gonna I got all kinds of stuff to do so we'll do that so Dear Lord, um, we just thank you again for your truths, your word, and living in a country that we can still, um, to this day, that we can still uh, read it openly. A lot of our brothers and sisters can't, can't do that, and uh, we thank you and praise you for that, and we pray that you'd be with them. Lord, speak to us. Um, help me to follow more in in your will totally um giving it all to you no matter what it is my desires my wants um whatever my dreams um i pray that they would fall into your will and uh your will would be done in my life and that i would please you um use this and speak to somebody else out there and, and bless them. Be with everyone that's watching. I pray that you would bless them and keep them. <clears throat> Just continue to guide us. And we give you all the praise, glory, and honor for, for everything that we accomplish and, and everything that uh, you give us. And we, uh, we ask these things in the precious name of Jesus Christ, our Savior. Amen. All right, guys. Well, got to keep moving. So we'll uh, catch up with you on a, another video. Have a good one.